Make the perfect maple salmon at home. We have Chef Greg here from Stratford University joining us this morning yes. with a very unique recipe. I've never yes. heard of that. Never heard of it? No. It actually works a lot better when you have the true maple syrup, uh -huh. like Canadian maple syrup or right. whatever the case is. But um, it, it works just as well as the, the log cabin and the right. Aunt Jemima stuff and all that. It, it does, it's a little sweeter because they use the high fructose corn syrup as mm -hmm. opposed to natural um, maple sugars. But yeah, it works, it works fantastic. We have a very, very hot pan here. Okay. And what we're going to do is just put a little oil in, just a smidge. I was worried that was going to... No, no, there's no I water. Up. There's no water in the pan, so it's not going to... And once you see a little smoke... And if you want to, you can hit it with some kosher salt or some iodized salt or whatever to give you that sweet and salty flavor. Right. I have the skin on. It's becoming more popular because there's a nice layer of fat that you take off when you take off the skin. Okay, so you do so, eventually take it off. Exactly. Well, you can also eat the skin if you wish. Okay. All right, and we're just going to let that crisp What do you up. prefer, keeping it on or taking it off? I'm a fan of either, okay. really. They I, both taste good. Exactly. Okay. And then um, while that's going, you can get your rice, pasta, salad, whatever you wish to serve with this mm -hmm. particular dish. And you're gonna get a nice crispy layer on it. Um, and then on the flip it over, get a nice crispy layer on the other side. And if you can see, it's slightly medium mid-well on the oh, inside. Oh, that's how I like that. That's, uh, yeah, and that's that how most good. people like their salmon. And how long, did, how many minutes did you say to get um, that? About three minutes on one side, flip it over, give another three, four minutes on the other side, that's right. fresh. You can cook this from frozen as well. Okay. And it's just gonna take a little longer to cook through and if you want to you can finish it in the oven if you right. want it like well done but yeah that's all you really need to do and as you see it's easy uh, when I first put it in it sort sort of stuck to the pan a bit but now that it's nice and caramelized it what is almost ready it's almost ready you're okay what about the okay, <laughs> I'm a little antsy in that's the kitchen okay. what about the maple syrup when does the that maple come syrup in? goes on as soon as you take it off and put it over top of your pasta salad or whatever you just give it a nice little fine drizzle right on top and Looks great. you're ready to go and the light sweetness of the sugar plus the richness of the salmon plus if you add that salt aspect to it, yeah, it has, those contrasting flavors just really hit it. And wow! You're not getting a lot that. of calories from the uh, you're not getting a lot of calories from maple syrup. Right, not much. and you can get sugar free too. I, exactly, if you wish, and you know you have the omega threes from the from the fish. It's all that whole healthy healthy for January. meal. Chef Hare, yeah. thank you very much. A thank new you. recipe for me and hopefully for you guys you too. Go. If you want to learn more information about it, log on to foxbaltimore.com. Slash morning. Thank you again. Thank you.